Hello everybody, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how to download and install Particle Rain for Minecraft Java. So, let's get started. The first thing you'll do is go to your web browser, and I will have links in the description if you need them. But here, all you'll do is go to your search bar and search up for modwinf, like so. Here, once you enter, you'll find modwinf.com, just go on modwinf and then you'll be on the modern homepage. From there, all you want to do is go on the top of the website to discover content and you want to go down to mods. Now, all you want to do is go on search mods and you want to search up Particle Rain. And here you'll find Particle Rain here and just go ahead and click on the name and this will bring you to the Particle Rain homepage on Modern. From there, all you want to do is go to versions and now you want to go to game versions and choose what Minecraft version you want to play. I'm gonna choose the latest one they have. And from there, all you want to do is make sure this is your version for Fabric and click the green download button. But here you also need to have some dependencies. So all you have to do here is click the version name of Parkovane. And from there, you'll find dependencies. You'll find two of them here. So you'll find Fabric API and yet in other config lib and mod menu is optional. So we need to have these two ones here to use Particle Rain. So here all you want to do is click Fabric API, click the button. From there you want to go to versions. And then you want to go to game versions and choose the same game version you did for Particle Rain. So for me it was 1.21.5. And from there, uh, just go ahead and find your version, find Fabric and click the green download button. And here all you want to do is go to the top left arrow to go back to the dependencies area. Here is this dependencies version here and here you want to go in yet in other config lib and just like before go to versions go to game versions and choose your version that you did for fabric api and particle brain so i did 1.21.5 here find fabric 1.21.5 and click the green download button and now you have everything you need so now all you want to do is go to another tab and you want to go ahead and search up for fabric mine so Fabric Minecraft and here you'll find FabricMC.net, just click on Fabric and this will bring you to the Fabric homepage. Here all you want to do is click the blue download button and now all you want to do is click the blue download for Windows button here. And from there you're going to have Fabric Installer. So all you want to do here is simply go ahead and close your web browser and now you want to go to your file explorer to access your downloads folder. From there all you want to do is find Fabric Installer and double click it. And this will show up with the window like this and here for the Minecraft version, just choose the same Minecraft version you chose for all the three mods here. So for me it was 1.21.5 and click install, okay, and close. And now all you want to do is go to the Minecraft launcher and this is how you'll be able to go ahead and add the three mods to the mods folder. So basically here we have Fabric Loader and all you want to do is go to installations here. And then you want to go to Fabric Loader and go to the folder icon. From there, all you want to do is simply go ahead and find Mods somewhere. Here's the Mods folder. Double click it. And from there, you want to go to Downloads. And you want to select the three mods and copy them. And from there, you want to go to the top left arrow to go back to the previous folder and click Paste. Here we have copy pasted yet in other config lib, Fabric API, and Particle Rain in .mark of Mods. So once you did this, all you have to do is go to the Minecraft launcher again. You want to go to play and once you're here, make sure Fabric Loader is selected and click play. And now you have to wait for Minecraft to open up. Okay. So once we have Minecraft here, we can go to a single player world for example. And from there, we can go to a tutorial world and try out Particle Rain. So all you have to do here is simply get yourself some weather event as Parkour Rain works of weather. So we'll just do slash weather and we'll do thunder here. And you should notice that we have a bit of a different weather pattern than normal Minecraft. So here we can see we have rain basically changes here, how the rain goes sideways kinda. It looks a bit better. There's little rain particles as well. And there is even little puddles of water that accumulates over time because we have rain falling down. The lightning looks a bit different, a bit more often as well, and we also have ground fog as well, which makes it look really nice. So yeah, 
that is Spark Rain. It makes everything a bit more realistic and also adds a bit more violence to the game by adding different weather pattern and weather effects as well. So yeah, that is how we get ourselves Particle Rain for Minecraft Java. So if you liked today's video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one. Bye.